right, let's go to Ashley Spicer, who's in the newsroom right now. Ashley. All right, Bruce, you know, several injured were treated at Memorial Hospital, and I spoke with one of the men there recovering. Uh, he was actually shot, grazed by a bullet the side of his head. He was in great spirits today, uh, kind of ran through what happened. He said that his back was to the door when the shooter entered the room, and he at first thought that he'd been punched in the back of the head, but he heard the sound of the gun go off, and he realized it was a gunshot wound. Now, Chris McFarlane is 31 years old. He traveled all the way from Philly for this gaming tournament. He said he never expected anything like this to happen. It was definitely a rough situation, you know, I mean, all I can think about is yesterday, what happened at the gaming tournament, pretty much my thoughts and pretty much different situations run through my head if, you know, if everybody was moved a different way, if someone wasn't there in front of me, if the shooter had seven more bullets, whatever it may be, those are the situations I continuously run through my mind. McFarland said they scrambled to the ground as soon as he was hit and he saw that shooter firing at his friends. One of those men who died, Eli, was sitting in the exact same chair that McFarland was just 10 minutes prior. And McFarland will be released from the hospital today. He is happy to be going home to his family. I'm live, Ashley Spicer, Channel 4, The Local Station.